All right, okay, all right, okay. What's up, buddies? Welcome back to another episode of The Poor Man Road to Glory. It's been a little, been about three days, actually, since uh, I've been home, since I've been on this account. If you follow me on Instagram, you can see a photo dump of, like, our little mini vacation away for my uh, little brother's wedding. Nevertheless, it was nice to get away for a couple of days, and uh, also nice to be back for this series. It's kind of amazing, man. I, I have to say the, the support that you guys are given with how we're doing things right now kind of makes me want to do it again next year. Starting a poor man road to glory for team of the season. I, I didn't think I'd be having a, a, a limited time road to glory, right? A two to three hour a day poor man road to glory, no FIFA point. What are all the things that we know that this series is? It's kind of nice. I don't know what it is that's making me enjoy this so much, which then translates over or mirrors over to the content i make and then i think you guys kind of feel the fun that we're having on this series I, I i don't know i don't know if it's the time limitation i don't know if it's because we're still kind of succeeding and doing pretty well with the series um i don't know if it's maybe i'm motivated because on twitch the support is huge and on youtube again the support is huge so I don't know. I, I I feel almost like a fraud because I'm actually having way more fun than I want uh, than I thought I would on Ultimate Team in mid May of probably, in my opinion, the worst gameplay and the worst servers us as a FUT community have ever seen. Especially if you're dumb enough like me to actually play on PlayStation Five build as opposed to going back to PS4 where apparently the gameplay is a little bit cleaner. Anyways, I'm loving it. Long may it continue. Uh, we have a little bit of an update for you guys. We're at six wins in champs. Like I said, we played a little bit on the Friday, a little bit on the Sunday, um, just to so that today I didn't have 20 games to play. So I think we've got nine to 11 games left. I don't believe we're going to get all of our champs games in today. The target, I think, is still going to be nine wins. And then when we get nine wins, or if we can get nine wins, then we'll see how many games we have left to maybe make a last gasp push to 11 wins if we can, of course, do that. So that will most likely be split up across today and tomorrow, as long as EA don't end uh, champs again, like they didn't screwed over everybody last week. So I would heavily get screwed over if, let's say, we only played five games today and left four or five games till tomorrow, and then EA ended it. Well, we wouldn't even probably won't even be on nine wins by the end of today. Here's hoping that we will be, though. So that's going to be the plan for gameplay. Got a lot to catch you guys up with. I haven't even looked at content. So even though I kind of logged in on the Friday... Um, it was before content, and then I logged in again on, on the Sunday and stuff like that a little. I tried my best to stay away from content, so I actually don't really even know who's in the damn team of the season. Well, now we're going to have a little look at it, and I actually don't even really know who's in the Sunday team of the season. The Twitch chat uh, told me that it was... I actually thought my chat was trolling when people were like, we got, I got Red Alfonso Davies! What?! Team of the season Davies. Now, fair enough. I haven't really been paying much attention to the Bundesliga. I usually keep up to date with what the Canadian boys are doing. So Alfonso Davies at Bayern, you know, Jonathan David, a few of the boys in Turkey and stuff. I try to keep up with it, but I haven't really paid any attention. I thought Alfonso was out for a good amount of time. Uh, with with his COVID issues and the swelling of his heart and stuff like that. So he still did enough through the year to get in the team of the season. And is that a fair shout? I mean, I could care less if it was a fair shout or not. I'm happy and I desperately want that card for left mid in 3-5-2. It's a bit undeserved. Hey, I'll take it all day. I love that he got in. I have no idea how he got in, which is why I'm like, I haven't followed the Bundesliga, but how has he gotten in? I'm a bit, I'm a bit a little bit confused, but I'm not upset. Um, as a Bayern fan, it's not deserved, but hey, we'll take it, right? Also, I told, I don't know if I mentioned it in this series, but I've been talking about it a lot on uh, my Twitch chat. I am still in love with that 82 red Jude Bellingham that we got on the first owner road to glory near the start of the year. And I was so excited at, at, at just Jude Bellingham is balling right now and has been balling for a couple of years for his young age and doesn't get a lot of media coverage really. And I, I just don't understand why. So I was really excited to see what his team of the season was going to look like. And that might be, I know it's a little bit small, so you might have to like zoom in if you're on your phone or whatever, or into the, to the screen. Cause I can't pull it up unless we go over to the, uh, uh, to the, whatever the, uh, team management, but that Bellingham looks cracked. In fact, um, I'm just going to have a quick look at the Saudi league because I've been told that if, wait, Where's the Saudi league? All right, whatever. I've been told that the, there's quite a few good Saudi league players. Yeah, it's really stupid that you can't... You know this screen right here? 
You know how we have that for Team of the Week? I know I've said this across about eight or nine years on Twitch, but hey, yay, why in the living fuckery, now the video's demonetized because I've said the F word and YouTube can't handle the F word. Anyways, why can't we just click the Team of the Seasons like this, in this screen like you can with the dead Team of the Weeks? Why is that something they don't do? It's the year 2029. And we still can't click Team of the Seasons and look at their cards? Like you have to search them in concepts or go look on the trade pile still? This has been a requested thing for years and years and years. And I know oh, I gotta go over here and then I gotta go to club and then I gotta I gotta search Bellingham and then I gotta I gotta remember that he's in or I gotta remember yeah, like I can't go just look at the players that have made it in. Yeah, Fudbin has it. Sick one. Armalika knows that's a trigger for me, so he tells me Futbin has it. Yeah, let me go to an I love Futbin. I, they're all sweethearts. I love those guys. I'm so proud of them. I'm so proud of the money they made. Um, selling their 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 website. They're 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 the best, dude. They're absolutely the best. They support our charity stream like crazy. But it's mad, mad that I need to go to off console onto the internet onto a different website to look at d different players that they release in promos. Clueless. EA are utterly clueless. Anyways, now that I've had my little baby rant for the epi, let's have a look at the card I'm most excited about dude now if they just gave him a cheeky five-star weak foot though i'm not saying it's deserved but oh god anyways it doesn't matter four star four star high high work rates six one with those stats slap my ass and call me sally i need him i need him i desperately 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 need this card i have no idea how i'm gonna get him and i can only imagine he's exorbitantly expensive but deserved also would you guys argue the Bundesliga team of the season is f way better than the Prem in terms of player stats and, and, and changes and improvements? Or uh, is it because it's just what I'm looking at right now? Dude, like, even Alfonso Davies. Look at, look, at this, look at this Davies card, man. I think he's still high-low work rates, right? I don't actually know. You tend to not change defensive player work rates. Bro, are you, are you nuts? I need, I need, I need. I need, I need, I need him and I need Jude. And I don't know how I'm going to make it happen. I don't know how. All right, Sally, 2018. I should get him, right? Oh my God. I don't know what chem style I would give him. Defensively and physically, he's perfect for the left mid spot in 3-5-2. He will be the best left mid in 3-5-2 outside of that. You know that Marcelo? Oh my God. That Marcelo, bro. I wish I could have tried tested him out in the 3-5-2. Bro, that Marcelo. What is he, a 93 rated card? Is that the fuck birthday Marcelo? That easily would be the best left mid in the game in a 3-5-2 setup. I think it was a fun birthday Marcelo, right? Oh, fuck Captain Marcelo. Yeah, yeah, that one. That one. Oh, God. This Davies is only 275k. I think if I were to sell off some items in the club, I'd be able to get him. Um, in fact, I think I'd be able to get him no problem. And then I could link him with Zule. Ooh, that's an idea. But that would probably be all of my coins. That, that will most likely be all of my... We might just be able to... If I sell off some of the other items in our uh, team, we should, we should be able to afford them. So anyways, I need Fonzie. I need Jude Bellingham. Th those are the two ones that I desperately want. Is there any other ones you want me to look at? I know it's... It's been three days, so I'm sure you guys have all looked at these. Do, do you care for me to look at any of these? Um, what about... Uh, no, not Nicolan Kulu. Hold on. <coughs> Here we go. The man that is might break the record for most cards uh, in a FUT release. I think Salah has it from FIFA 18, but I think he's one or two... I think Nkunku's one or two cards away from breaking Salah's record of most cards in one FUT year. Oh, are you kidding me, though? I'd love for I would have loved for him to be high medium, but that's okay. Good lord. Nah, the Bundesliga is nuts, man. The the Bundesliga is nuts. Wait, Alioski got in? Oh my god, for the passive hold on, everybody for the passive president leads setup. Did he actually get in? Do you understand how badly we missed this guy at Leeds this year? Did he get in? I mean, that's insane. The skill moves in weak foot are so bad. That should be at least three star, four star, but 
Bro, do EA even watch the games? Do they watch the players that they give special cards to? Like, do they have any idea or no? Because that is so incorrect for his card. For anybody that has watched Elios get leads for years and years, that is insane. But anyways, the high, high work rates, you better have insane high stamina. Good. Anyways, yeah, they definitely don't watch the games. With, with those physical stats, high, high work rates is fair. Height obviously is fair, but the skill move in weak foot is ridiculous. Anyways, whatever. Very cool card. Oh, God. How the heck would I fit him into the setup? Get him on 7 chem, I guess, with um, with SCN, maybe? Guys, I need to test out this Alioski. I have to. I have to. It would be ridiculous if I didn't. How did only one person just mention this just now? Knowing that I'm a lead. I love Alioski, bro. He was like the heart and soul of the lead setup for the longest time. How we just let him leave was just ridiculous, man. No proper farewell, really, either. Annoying. I'm really annoyed. Uh, Firpo has been pretty bad this year and pretty injury prone, but actually against um, against Brighton, he was pretty decent. That was a good game. I can't I can't fault Junior Firpo for, for his game against Brighton. He's just been marred with injuries all year. 21k for him okay we're, we'll we'll test i might even mm, i might even buy him for tomorrow's games i might i might buy this uh this uh, this alioski for tomorrow's games we'll, we'll figure out how we fit him into the setup okay let's just go boys I, there's too much man it's been 15 minutes of this intro i i still haven't even gotten through anything yet and we need to play games so uh youtube i tried to hold on to all this stuff i mean as always you you know you can watch it on stream but there's the profits from the last like three days of just selling off players and as you know we sell every single item that's tradable it's just what we're doing on this series to keep the account as liquid as possible Still haven't been able to sell these four guys. So I think if and when these guys expire, I'll either put them in the club or maybe discard them for the extra little bit of coins. But we've updated you there. Uh, we had a bunch of objectives, but all kind of like little crappy ones. So I didn't really think it was important to show you within the two hour episode. I kind of just claim them um, uh, before we started the epi right, right at the beginning on stream. Again, we turn on the stream at about 4 p.m. UK every day. If these two hour episodes aren't enough for you, know that we're in and around on this account from about 4 30 p.m uk till about 7 30 p.m uk we record the official episode from 5 to 7 p.m on twitch first link in the description twitch.tv slash nick 28t if you wanted to jump in and uh and have a look anyways we got a mega pack there from the season objectives we've got ourselves this was actually on uh thursday's epi we got this win i just forgot <laughs> sorry i forgot to claim this so hey you got a mega pack for today's epi which is good looking like tomorrow's gonna be weekend league rewards and just there's no way we get nine games in especially with how much i have to uh catch up and then we got another dead two rare gold player pack here as well so we'll claim that and i think that's it for getting all caught up did i miss any big sbcs that i should be paying attention to before we open the packs and get into gameplay still want that photo and dude oh Ooh. well i won't be doing them no matter what oh my you start this guy right back and make him a center back hello give him a backbone too oh my da costa would be an insane center back no uh we're on six wins with nine or ten games remaining i believe Dude, imagine this guy as a right center back in a, in a 3 5 2. There you go. Wow. Yeah, he'd have to be pretty nuts. He, was he high, high work rate? Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah. High, high might be a bit annoying, but other than that, what a card. My goodness. Okay. I don't get players, any of these types of players we don't do on this series, but for any of you guys that, uh, that did him. Oh my God, dude. Imagine axel witzel and bellingham together you can't call this a rat card anymore dude wait is he cheap to, to make him a rat card Man, i don't know if that's necessary it's still about 200k right i don't know if that's cheap but that is I, I think that's a very fair price i think that's a very very fair price what do you get? Jumbo premium gold pay. I mean, the, the pack return is dead, but what a card, man. Again, wish he was medium high. I think medium medium might make him a bit frustrating to use defensively, especially defensively, uh, unless you just control him the entire time. 
So this is part of the Saudi League setup. Oh, wow. Four-star, four-star, too. What I really like, one of my favorite things about Team of the Season, I think Nep feels the same. I don't know. I, I mean, I, I haven't heard him say this or not, but I've heard him say this in the past. Not, not this year, but nevertheless. One of my favorite parts about Team of the Season is the off-leagues that get these crazy fun cards where if you're a fan of the Saudi League or a team in the Saudi League or whatever the case may be, you could put together a full Team of the Season special setup and run a weekend league and give any team a challenge if you're good enough at the game. Now, you're going to come up against a Moments R9 and a Moments Cruyff setup, and if the guy is as good as you, he might beat you, right? Because equal opponents, if that's when the god squads really make the difference. If you're better, if you, if you can keep your whole, your, 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 yourself together and your, your, your rage at bay, you could run a Saudi League team or an Eredivisie team and probably crap on next to everybody that you came up against. The squad would give you that opportunity, and then it would just be up to you as to whether or not you performed, but... Or you had good enough gameplay to perform too, right? That's always something to consider. Nevertheless, that card looks cool. I, f I feel like I missed so much. Bro. Huh? That is the best dynamic image I've ever seen. High, low, 6-2, uh, 4-star, star, four star as well. Wow. Hey, bro, that is the best dynamic image I have seen ever. I want to, I, I, by the way, I want a hat like that. I don't know if it's the Peaky Blinders that makes me want a hat like that, but I really do. His Selly is great as well. He stole the hat from his coach. <laughs> That's amazing. Anyways, what a, what a fantastic dynamic image. I don't know if you guys really care about him. Oh my God. Wait, he's almost more expensive than, uh, he's almost more expensive than Axel Witzel. That's weird. How much is this dude, by the way, if we want to consider the cost of the Saudi League? 84 rated, no inform. Okay, so we're talking about, what, 50k? 40, 50k? Probably about 40k, right? Maybe a bit less? 30 to 40k. Yeah, that's, okay, that's well-priced. I like that. Benzo, and did we miss anything else, boys? Cristiano got his dynamic. Marquee matchups. I do need to finish up that as well. Uh, has there been any new tokens added? Let me, let me actually just go over to the team of the season. Did, I, I didn't miss anything. Interesting. Okay. Cool. Team of the season challenge one, we, we did. We got that one knocked out of the way. And then live stuff, I don't think we missed anything. He's 20k cheaper than Witzel? Oh. Okay. My bad. My bad. I kind of want to do this, but I, there's just no time. I don't think we'd be able to craft this. See, this would be something I'd craft on this series. I know a lot of you guys are like, wait, I thought you're not, you're, you're staying liquid. I, I would, but I also have an insane amount of untradeable players already. So we got to figure out where to put them. And I think in a pack where we could be a little bit of a degen, we don't know where, what we're going to get from the pack. I think that'd be very cool. Right. 21 minute, 21 minute intro, boys. Dear God, I shouldn't take any days off ever again after how long it's taken me to get started on the epi today, but let's get uh, all these packs open, then we'll get gameplay, we'll see 6pm content, more gameplay, and then we'll finish with um, whatever upgrade pack. Who's this? Oh my god. I didn't pay attention if it was a walkout or not. Imagine, striker son. I mean, what would a 90 rated striker son have been in terms of flares? All 8 flares at once, right? So, yeah, I know. Couldn't have been young men, unfortunately, but it's an inform. That'll be usable at some point. I don't think I've ever used an architect, ever. I'll keep it, but I don't think that I've ever used it. A couple of players we can use for upgrade packs. <laughs> premium gold pack, premium gold player pack, player pack, 50k pack, mega pack, mega pack. Oh, we got some, got some, ooh, B? BL? Oh, Bundesliga. Okay, cool. Wait, why does it give us EFL instead of the Saudi League, though? It's a bit weird. Well, we all, we're not... I know I'm going to get three dead EFL players. Please, can I get Fonzie? That would be fun. Get Fonzie to use in the, um... In the Zule setup? That'd be nice. Lone Fonzie and a lone Bellingham? That'd be sick. Okay, got an 83. 
Are upgrades confirmed? I mean, it's Monday. I don't think anything is ever really confirmed, but it is Monday, so you'd think that upgrades would be coming on Monday. Well, that's a problem. How am I going to get my game started when I already have a dupe to deal with? 83 rated Fernandinho. Where do we put him? We put him in a marquee matchup, actually. Um, Stuttgart and Köln. Let's go see if there's a... Uh, if we have packed any of these guys. I don't think so. We sold them. I love Cologne, man. What a beautiful city with amazing fans. Stuttgart, Stuttgart. Am I blind? <laughs> Sorry. All right, so I don't I don't have this yet, so I'm not going to worry about that. Stade Rennes or Marseille. Leagues minimum four, players from the same country minimum three. Okay, so we might even be able to do a little Brazilian setup. Stade Rennes and Marcelli. Perfect. Wow. Got right, a little bit lucky there. Okay, so we got Spain. Got to get Fernandinho in. And thanks to Fernandinho's rating, we shouldn't have to worry at all about anything else, which is fantastic. 75 chem is going to be, I think, the biggest, biggest issue. We'll look at Brazil, and we'll go look at Spain. It's not great. I'm pretty efficient with my club, right? So I, I feel like we're not going to have a crazy amount of options here, are we? Oh, actually, hold on a second. Pain two. Uh, guarantee you I can use those two plebs. And... Okay. These guys I want to keep for La Liga. I think they're tradable too, so I, I, I think I want to hold on to them. I don't think I'll need a port two, honestly. How far off are we here? So, if I go and do this, striker, Spain, I honestly think no matter what the rating is, hold on, I'll be able to get it done. Okay, that's a problem. Um, oh, <laughs> there we go. That's what I thought I had it set up as. SBC brainchild. Don't ever doubt me, you batch. I don't know who I just called a batch, but I called somebody a batch. I feel good about it. And I'm gonna bring the alerts back too. Uh, Ghostly, thank you very much, man. Yasin, Franzen, Ryland, Stewart, copy of Famity, Daji, Totti, Red. Oh my. Okay, we've missed quite a few subs during that 27 minute intro. A Aaron. Oh yeah. Mads, Unrivaled, Goose Goose, Tyler, Matt, Pizza. God bless, boys. Thank you. Oh, we kind of got some big packs here, huh? I'm hyped about this. Sorry, I've been dilly-dallying. This is sick. Maybe we can even get a Bundesliga team of the season to kickstart the squad build. For the Bamba content that. Hey, much love, Vince. Okay, premium gold pack. Let's do that. Okay, so no board there. We'll skip it. Right back. That's Norwegian. Who in the heck is that? Oh. Oh, tradable. Oh, wait. Hold on a sec. Um, I'm going to throw all the tradable. Yeah, yeah. We're going to do that. That can all go. That actually sells. I don't know what it sells for, but I know it sells. I don't know what that sells for. There we go. Try 
Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. Come on. Let's see a team of the season here, babe. Give me Alioski. I just called the Pack Gods, babe. Uh, same thing. I'm going to throw these guys all up there. I don't know what their prices are going to be when upgrade packs are out, so I kind of want to just sit on that. <laughs> Oops. Pack gods don't like being called babe, I don't think. Uh, I'm telling Heather. I wonder if this sells. Nope. Just give me the 485. Dirt, thank you for the gifted sub to Matt. Appreciate you, my man. Much love. So, 25k pack, 25k pack, 50k pack. Two 35Ks. Let's open the two rare gold player pack. Come on, man. Surely we get a tots out of this, right? Even if it's a Saudi league? How has Packway been for other content carriers? I run the Fault Market Nep. How has it been for them? Has it been good? Oh, God. Um. Well, that's officially now a problem. Where do we put a mat tip? Where would I put my tip? Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, God. Jumbo Premium Gold Pack? Is this a good one? Jumbo Premium... Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. It's not a player pack, though. But it is tradable. So... Goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. Leagues, countries, German players. Dirt with five gifteds! Topping it up, baby. Thank you, Dirt. Okay, hold on. <laughs> So gross. All right. Okay. 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 Uh, do you have a GK? Do. German player. Let's see what we got here. One of the lessons that I grew up with was to always stay true to yourself and never let what somebody else says distract you from your goals. Hey, Heroes yeah. to another 10,000 months. Thank you, brother. 10,000 months. Hell yeah. What a legend. Thank you, Kai, for the 44. Amen to that message, too, bro. That's that's very, very important in life, I would say. Yeah, these mans are all untradeable, so... I mean, we might as well, right? Some people would argue that this dude should have been in ahead of Alfonso Davies. Gunter should have been ahead of Alfonso Davies. What are we saying? Yeah or nah? Nah or yeah? Okay, so we definitely got Kim. Yeah? Yeah, but it's Alfonso Davies, you frauds! Of course he should get in! Who's crying about that? Alright! Bundesliga Team of the Season 2 Challenge. Not that we needed it, but... Done. Davies is a one-season wonder. I will fight you in your face. Right now. Who said that? Um, any tips on a brand new FIFA player who's getting the game now? I'm not very good. Brother, I mean, this couldn't be a better time for you to ask that question. I would watch my um, Poor Man Road to Glory. You can either catch all the videos on Twitch or you can catch it on my YouTube channel, bro. From episode one onwards. And just kind of mimic. Please be tradable. Oh. Okay. And, and uh, just mimic what I do there. Definitely. That would be my recommendation, my man. Just got to play some games. Uh, maybe focus even on offline gameplay for the first little while. Build up your coin balance. Uh, BPM at times is still good this year. So I don't know how much that's worth. I'm just guessing, by the way. Same thing. No idea how much engines are worth. Uh, definitely not 1,400, but oh well. 1,000. 
And our 83s up in price or kind of just stable right now? Okay, so they're not really that that up in price at all. Yeah, and, and I mean, with squad battles, right? You can get yourself at least a team of the season, so that's not bad. Do we have squad battle rewards? Oh my god, I think we have squad battle rewards. Oh, we'll end the epi, I think, with squad battle rewards and a red pick. Hey, hey, let's go, baby! I forgot. God, I'm a stupid dumb sometimes, hey? Jumbo premium gold pack, okay. Nice. Oh my god, once the uh, upgrade packs are out, we're going to get rich off of selling all these players. This is going to be great. Uh, I It was... It was either left back or right back to right wing back cards that were going for honestly like two to three thousand coins. I think maybe it was during the prem. But I don't know if they're still up in that price. Can't check anyways. Thanks EA. So I'm guessing, but they were up in price quite a bit for 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 a while. Get rid of all that. It's another fifteen hundred coins. Finished a few hundred points off elite three. Oof, it's unfortunate. Okay, well let's open these. Bundesliga EFL uh, loan packs, also known as EFL loan packs. On Futbin, you can check the prices. Thanks, Armalika. I'm going to send a turd to Greece. Um, Rom. Okay, we did get a Bundesliga. That's a really cool dynamic image. I wonder what that says on his chest or his upper, upper booby plate, if you will. I don't know. Okay, so no Fonzie yet. We did get a left back from the Bundesliga. It wasn't Fonzie, unfortunately. Come on. Jude Bellingham or Fonzie here. Please, EA. Please, Pack Gods. Screw EA. Oh, my God. What? <laughs> uh... <laughs> well, we have him for the rest of the year in friendlies, at least. Dear God. <laughs> Where the hell did that come? <laughs> That's streamer pack luck, boys. Right there. Good stuff. All right. If I don't get actually anything good, the YouTube epi is going to be, oh my God, I got team of the season Alfonso Davies. And you can't get mad. It's not like I'm lying. Come on, YouTube. I got to get the clicks. This damn Porsche isn't going to buy itself for F sakes. Hello, five, 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 one, two is the new meta for me. Four, five, one, two is the new meta. So flat four, five, one. That's kind of wild. I'm assuming you got to have some proper player setups there, right? So Megas, I guess we'll open the 225 case first. Can use to unlock Sule. There you go. Okay, 87 or lower walkout. Oh, so dead. Red timing shots is the new meta. Don't say that. Don't tell me that there's now even more garbage meta in the game that people are discovering. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Nick becoming Villa and Palace fan on Thursday. Villa and? I think it's... Is it Newcastle? Who plays Burnley? Villa and... I hope they all smash. Yeah, Newcastle, right? I hope they all smash Burnley and Everton, man. The fact that Leeds' this season isn't even in our own hands, it, while it is in our hands, but it isn't in our hands. What a game yesterday, man. I Honestly, I, I think I lost a couple of hour, hours, a couple of years off my life yesterday. Okay. Whatevs. Man, I hope this guy makes a full recovery. You see his injury, man? <laughs> not using manual tackles has been the meta since FIFA 17. You're not wrong, and it's, it's, it's disgusting. I hate it. You get punished if you manually defend. Even when you successfully defend. Because they just phase through you like you don't exist. Dylan, thank you for the 22. I'm not excited for champs games. I'm really not. Even yesterday, like, I'm just so rusty. Takes so long to get used to the silly gameplay, man. Okay, no dupes, no dupes, no dupes. Oh, one dupe. Oh, God. I'm going to keep all of this. No! Where am I going to put Foden, man? Guitar dance? That's toxic AF. Please be tradable. Why would he be tradable? I would have never kept him if he was tradable. I don't know where to put Foden, dude. 
Ever Banega got a team of the season? Damn, that's kind of cool. Good for him. I didn't see that. Man, I'm so... Yeah, I'm lost. Put him into the Foden SBC? No, man. I only have one day. There's no way. Um, I got the one marquee matchup left. Panic. Unbelievably, I think I might just have to do the marquee matchup, man. I think I might just have to do the marquee matchup. Keep him until after 6 p.m. content. You know what? Not a bad suggestion. Not a bad suggestion. Yep. Well, actually, hold on. If in those few packs I got a Köln or a whatever the heck the other team is, Stuttgart player, I will do this. I didn't. Did anyone see if we got a, a Cologne or Stuttgart player? Let's see. Okay, no. Of course, they're going to be impossible to pack now, right? It's just the way it is. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Nope. Alright, we'll save it till 6pm. Loving the content. Thank you, Reefy. Appreciate that, man. Yanks, KSG, Dylan. Appreciate it, boys. Alright, well, focus on positivity here, boys, but we are going to go into gameplay. Actually, before we do that, let me, um, let me check out. Why is it forcing me into a big stadium again? Stupid game. I want, I want those flowers. Those flowers are so cool. Yeah, this thing. Look at that, man. What a sick kit. Campaign against living miserably is what my opponents are going to have, and they'll probably still watch full replays and make me miserable. And then I want a different Selly here, too. It's very toxic. But that's fine. If someone's being toxic, at least we have fire to fight with fire. Structure. Every time it switches me off of the structure. That I want to be on the crap one. Stop forcing me into the other ones, EA. You frauds. Keep the change, you filthy animal. I've never wanted Everton to go down more than this season. DCL to Shark Arsenal, week. hopefully. Shark Week? Yeah, yeah. Shark Week. Shark Week. Shark Week's coming. Canada just doesn't fit the setup, so unfortunately we'll go with Shark Week. Uh, Jimmy, thank you, man. I want Everton to go down so DCL goes to Arsenal. Oh, God. That's an extravagant wish list, I suppose. Do I have anything here that would be better? Teal blue. I mean, green and magenta is just cool. We'll keep it. Seat color. Only have... Only have gray, so that sticks. Stands. Root Hullet. Breakdancing is probably still the best option we got, right? Yeah. Gun. Sorry. Apologies. There we go. I don't deserve to have a bigger stadium set up than this, boys. This is what it's gotta it gotta gotta stay at for now. I'm kind of excited. Do not let me end the episode without these squad battle rewards, okay? Do not okay, nine games remaining. I really hope we can get nine wins. I'd like one chance at Alfonso Davies' red card, man. One chance. I might try and go for Elite One this week in squad battles too, man. To get to to get so can you get a Bundesliga higher rated player or no? Is the best you can do is the mid range. If you go elite one, can you even get a good Bundesliga player? I'm nervous. <clears throat> can you? Oh God, four bars. That's not ideal. Oh, what the hell is that, man? All right. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Be positive, Nick. Wait, did it just force my stadium to be big again? What the heck? Or is it his stadium? No, it's my stadium, man. So he might be playing very central base, right? If he's actually running a 4-3-1-2, very central he might be. Okay, so there, there's a perfect example of tackles. There's your perfect example of manual tackles. You being punished for them. Oh, nice try. Nice try, Saka. Nice try. Liam 
AI auto block, so P again. Ronaldo's away if he makes that pass. So is Kenny. Why is my team opening up for Ronaldo? Wow, what a save that is. Oh man, why is this guy's like AI so crazy? Let's go, SCN. That's a bad pass. That's my fault. Oh, he's on like high press. Okay. Let's go, McGinn. Big play. What an awful pass. I can't even make a simple pass. Oh, come on, man. The AI is so nuts. And he's going to get a corner? Can I get there? No. Dude, manual tackling is AIDS. What the hell? Like, I'm making tackles and he just falls through them. This is ridiculous. I gotta try and rein it in here, man. This is crazy, dude. Look at how long he's gonna take to settle the fucking ball. Fucking dead game. Just got AI controlled by Ryan, 2 OP. Okay, I'm gonna shut up. Yeah, I think you guys can all see what's going on here, so I'm just gonna shut up. There's no point. Yeah, you high press me, you nonce. Brother, please, man! This kid literally has his whole team sprinting at me, bro. I can't make him pay for any overcommitment. Good ball. It's a bit dangerous, but good ball. It's the worst pass I've ever seen. I, I can't. This is unbelievable. I might as well just score an own goal and let this guy win, man. I can't do anything. But meanwhile, he plays the ball into passing lanes that I cover. Like my players don't exist. Remember I said I was going to shut up? I still haven't shut up yet. Oh my god, bro. Hit it. Go, Ruben. What?! Oh, I'm going to lose my mind. I'm going to lose it. It's like 18 tackles, man. <laughs> this is the worst gameplay I've ever played in, I think. Look at this. Was it just because he's on high press? Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Just high press and that's it. Like, my whole team is just brain-dead twats. I can't, man. I literally can't make passes. It's fucking crazy, bro. And he's away. Nice read. Good manual defending. Yeah, punished for manual defending, but we're doing it. Cooper plays the ball out of bounds. <laughs> Fucking hell. So ridiculous. Holy the delay! I tried to play that through the middle, man. Oh, 
Oh, God. Oh, God. Champs is the worst thing ever. Can I also understand how this guy has been high pressing all game and his whole team's on full stamp still? I hate it. I hate this game. I, I really do hate this fucking game. It's crazy, man. I don't think this guy's running constant pressure either. I think what this guy is running is uh, he flip like he has two tactics. So he has one tactic on whatever, maybe press after possession loss. And then if I'm ever in my final third, he must have a tactic which keeps everything the same, but switches him on to constant pressure. And then that's, it's just game breaking. So he, like wh whenever he wants it, he just switches his tactic. So he's got this game breaking constant pressure. And the second I, I break his high press, you can see it. The second I break his high press, he switches back to pressure under constant. So I think that's how he's like breaking the game's mechanics. I think. I can't, I can't, there's no way that he's on constant pressure all game. His players should have zero stamps. So I think that might be what he's doing here. The second he's out of possession, he's just hitting, flipping a switch essentially. I love how my team doesn't move though. Come on. Awesome. Love it. Great. Great delay in the pass. Great delay in the pass. I, I really, really enjoy it. I'm literally being pressed by four fucking players, man. How? That's Jota, man. Fucking that pass up. Nice try. Not sure how I got that shot off, but we'll take it. We'll take it. All right, I gotta relax. I'm way too hungover for playing champs, man. Three-day wedding, man, and I'm sitting here trying to deal with this insanity, bro. Fucking hell. This guy's, like, plugged into the Matrix, for God's sakes. Oh, what an AI block that was! Oh my god, how does AI track that run so well? But no worries, man! Literally a through ball through the middle and that's game over. What the f***ing hell, bro? Bro, guys, like, I ain't making this up, right? Look! Look at the difference! What the f***? I can't do, boys! I can't do anything! This is infuriating, but look! But meanwhile, I make tackles and he plays it through my players like they don't exist! <laughs> what the fuck? What? I don't know why I'm doing this to myself, genuinely. I have no idea why I'm doing this to myself. I have no clue. No worries. The worst pass of all time, even though I put a half bar of power on it. I d dude. I don't know. Boys, I gotta shut up. I gotta just shut up. I'm not gonna say anything productive here. I'm just gonna complain because the gameplay is so bad. So I gotta just stop talking. Honestly, God. That's a three-star weak foot. What? I usually don't shoot with uh, Bruno's left. Nice tackle, though. Nice tackle again. Have the ball, though, buddy. Just have constant chances. There you go. I'm sure this will work no matter what you do here. Unreal. Offside. <sighs> Wait. Is it offside? Wait, what is happening? Okay, we're good. Nice, good show for the pass there, Mitchell. Cristiano Ronaldo, world's best. <laughs> Bro, what is that touch, man? Take a deft touch into space. I can't. This gameplay is horrific. Saka just tried to do a pirouette. 
but like he was wearing cement shoes. Oh my lord. <laughs> it does not matter what he does. <laughs> Holy shit. Come on. Focus, 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 focus. Ruben Diaz. And this is Diogo Jota now. Of course, defending. just runs to nowhere. Nice tackle. Oh, the heaviest touch ever. Oops, almost red time that. I don't, I don't know if a uh, good tackle. Oh wait, so yeah, we are we aren't home. Dude. Oh my god! I can't just pass! A stupid game! Watch that be a red card too. I can't, boys. The delay is insane. Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. If he scores here, I guarantee you he ties it up before the end of the game. Come on. Right, there you go. Wow, D dude, I will say this. David De Gea has been incredible. Wow. I was a d He's made two insane saves. I don't think you can take that away from him, man. Okay, I tried to ball roll! I'm gonna lose it! I, don't let me be Ruben or anything. It's fine, man. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Diogo Jota. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Cooper. Michael Essien. Dude, what? Nice tackle. Okay, we got to be smart here. Might be able to get in behind the defense. Nice. Mitchell, the cross is on. It might be on for them. He went offside, didn't he? Hundred percent. You just knew it. You just knew it. I think that was a pretty good play or a good idea there, but my god, zero football knowledge for my attacking players right now. Well, all game, I would have to say. I've hated a lot on uh, Bruno, but he's been pretty big this game. Get fucked. Get fucked. Let's go. I don't know how I won that. Does anyone know how I won that? I don't know how I won that. This is one of those games where I feel like I need to watch back, maybe in the YouTube video, to see if it looks as bad as it felt for me. Because I know I complained a lot in that game, but oh my god, bro. That was... Rough. Very rough. It did? Yeah, but I feel like my, my Twitch viewers are very nice to me. They give me the benefit of the doubt. YouTube. Also for you guys, let me know if that first game of the uh, of the Epi, if that looked as bad as it felt for me, man. Maybe this guy just knew all the broken mechanics of the game, so it exacerbated the delay. That could be something else. There, and I think this is important to talk about here before we get into 6 p.m. content, right? Um, I, I, I think he created a lot of goal scoring opportunities, and, and I think he knew all the broken mechanics to make the delay seem like it was worse. So I think in every game of FIFA, you have very heavy delay. The movement is terrible. But... I think this guy made it seem even worse because anytime I was moving with the ball on any part of the field, like he was high pressing me with Suarez and Ronaldo. And then he had like his, his defensive guys all off the ball, closing me down as well. So it could be just, he was really good at breaking the game's mechanics. So it made it feel worse. I don't know, but that was, that felt like one of the worst games ever in a long time. Gameplay looked good, but I know how bad the, it felt on your part. Hmm. Yeah, so there you go. I mean, it's just hard to translate it onto a screen. If, you, if you're if you not in control of it, 
I just, dude, I swear I'm not that brain dead. I, I swear to God, across 90 minutes, I do. This is this is the point I'm trying to make. I, I swear to you guys, I'm not so bad at this game that across those 90 minutes, I walk the ball into him high pressing me over and over. You know, what was it? 50 different times where he would constantly, I'd beat him. And then my player just wouldn't do anything. And then he'd re-tackle me after failing the first two or three tackles. That right there is not me just being stupid and holding onto the ball forever. I'm trying to make passes. I'm trying to make movements up the field, but my players are just like, even that pass to Saka, there was that one pass where I played the ball to him. All I wanted was one touch. So I'm going to take a touch, open his body up, and then play in uh, um, Jota. And Saka took a touch, turned one way, turned another way, and then was facing away from where I wanted him to, to but I loaded the pass already. So then he tried like a 350 degree spin pass. So... I swear I'm not that brain dead. I wouldn't do that on purpose if that makes sense, right? The players are just making some weird ass movements, but doesn't matter. We're on seven wins. So that's good enough for me. Uh, I have no idea where, what the, what is the dupe that we got to deal with here? Foden. Oh my God. Yeah. Foden. Where am I going to put Foden, man? We're a few seconds away from 6 PM content. So we'll get to see what, uh, what we have available to us. And then we can kind of decide where that Foden goes. Body animations all over the place are infuriating. But what's worse too is those tackles, man. Shotgun runs. I love these for some reason. We'll do a we'll do a shotgun to hero run on Tarkov later tonight. Um, yeah, even me tackling. Like I felt like he he would win the ball first attempt from his AI making the tackle. And I felt like a lot of my manual tackles, he just phased through them. At the end of the game, though, I think I clutched up. I think I made a lot of really good manual tackles to stop his counterattacks. That worked out well. And then let's not ignore the fact that De Gea made at least three game-saving saves there. Like, I, I I don't deserve all the credit for, for everything that happened. So let's have a look at 6 p.m. content. Let's see what type of upgrade packs we get for this week. Uh, okay, so we have to do this one. So maybe I even put, uh, maybe I put Foden in here. What's the reward for it? Jumbo premium gold players. It's untradeable though, you fraud ZA. Why would you do that? I like when it's tradable. 80 rated? Oh, they know. And now nine rares. And 95 chem. What the hell is this? That's the most overpriced stupid thing ever for a token. EA, shame on you, man. What the heck is that, dude? Just because they know people want the token. So they know they can overprice the SBC. That's disgusting. That is a terrible value, by the way, but I will do it because as we want the tokens. Um, so double upgrade, repeatable for three days. No PPs for this week? It's a 50K pack though? I mean, it's not really a 50K pack. It is, but it isn't, but it is, but it isn't. So I, still, I think for a token, EA know what they're doing there. Hold on, 72 rated. 72 rated. And 30 chem. Dude, to all my boys that are doing silver upgrade method through the BPM. This is, do you understand how big this is? Do you guys understand how massive of a dub this is? You can rinse your whole club of rare bronzes and silvers. And then just throw in one or two 83s or 84s. In fact, I don't think I have enough rares on this account. Silver rares to the moon as well. I honestly think bronze rares will go to the moon. So anything you have tradable as silver rares and bronze rares, sell them. My god, this is an L? You have no idea what you're talking about, Nova. Wait, no, he's right. I have no idea what I'm talking about. It says min quality silver. Okay, that's a bit ass. But if you're doing the silver upgrades, that's still good. I think it's still good. I would get rid of all of your untradeable silvers that you can't use in League SBCs and whatever here. And then your tradable stuff sell. That's what I would do. I didn't see the minimum silver. So technically, I have no idea what I'm talking about. I take that back, Nova. <laughs> um, all right, 25k pack. I, I, I never really care about these unless it's team of the year. Yeah, Nova's super smug about it. <laughs> uh... 45 chem. Is this what the prem was? I don't think these are worth doing, personally. Not anymore, but that's just my thoughts. I don't think this is really that great to do either. 
I do like this for your untradeables. I still think you can make this work very nicely. And then your tradable silvers are going to go up in price. So I, I think this is a win across the board for anyone running an RTG. I do. Not as good as what I thought it was originally if you could use bronzes. But still, I think it's fantastic. Now, where are our upgrades? 75 plus times 10. Oh. 80 plus times three player pick. Wait, so, but no, where, no, you guys said there were the, where are the 75 plus peepees? Those are gone. Wait, no. Is this what it is? 84 rate. Hold on a second. 75 plus times 10 upgrade. Do you understand that all this is, is a glorified gold Bundesliga player pack? That they try and make dumb people in the community submit an 84 rated squad for. And a team of the season. Am I missing something here? Hold on. 75 plus. Okay, so it's a rare. But it's still at the end of the day, it's like a Bundesliga specific 50k pack. It, it's still so bad. I'm understanding this correctly. I'm not missing anything here, right? It's not like that says I'm, I'm having like a brain meltdown and that says 85 plus. I mean, then that would be cheap, of course. A team of the season, 84, 60 chem for a Bundesliga 50k pack. I mean, I'm not, I, ref, I would never do that. You're out of your mind if you do that. Or you just have a lot of fodder and you've got a big account, maybe. But I would never do that. Um... Well, let's see what type of a ripoff this is then, boys. So, all rare, 50 chem, golds, of course, for one player pick. I don't think any of these are worth. Again, if you've got a big account, a rich man account, a long-term poor man road to glory or first owner account that you've started from the start of the year, go for it, obviously. Have your fun, right? Do these. For a new dad road to glory, two to three hour a day grind, I just don't think any of these are worth. 50 chem is nuts too. It's not going to be easy to get. I honestly think this might be the only... I don't even know. This might be the only thing worth doing. I honestly think this might be the only thing worth doing. What? Am I wrong in that thought process? I mean, this is a ripoff, but I'm going to do it because of the token. What, what do you guys think? Bundesliga 1, players from the same league, minimum 5. 95 chem is stupid. What is happening here? It's 3 PPs? What do you mean it's 3 PPs? No, I, I, well, well I, get, I get that it's 1 league, but still, I just think 95 chem is insanity. Um, let me see what I got. How many rares was it again? Oh my god, nine rares. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. One sec. Okay, that was Serie A. Turkey. France. I got two French players. No. I don't think I'll, I don't think I can do this. Genuinely. I don't think this is going to be possible. Foden, right? It was Phil Foden. Saka can give a strong link to Foden. Okay, there we go. We got a French link there, and I got a Bundesliga uh, player, so that's good. I have two, two Prem CBs. I mean, 83s are as cheap as, as rares, so. 
Does that work? Okay, so I don't I don't have the chem. Nor do I have the rares. Okay. That's fine. Doesn't actually help us out either. It's a bit wild. Um Hmm. Okay, maybe maybe I go with La maybe I go with La Liga. That's a nice thing in objectives. Wait, EA have made new objectives? What have they done with objectives? I must have missed something there. How Torres might be able to do this though. GK, Pau Torres. No. No way. They've given people a 45k pack and 1500 XP. I never, you know what? I never got anything on this account. Did they just start pushing it out now? Yeah, I got, I got nothing on this account. Um, I might actually go with a prem rare. Oh, you know what's? This is not. This is just gonna cost too much, isn't it? Let's see. Oh, maybe not. Lazy twenty eight I'm just. I just want to get this over with. Okay, and have any other prem player that would make any other prem player. Damn, it stays, it stays 80 rated too, which is kind of crazy, isn't it? Um, that is nuts that it stays 80 rated. Easily get the chem too, so let's do this. Just need a rare now. Might be a bit overkill, actually. This donkey out of here. Hey! Who's the dupe, by the way? Oh, Foden, right? Okay. We did it, guys. We got ourselves, the t I think we've got all the tokens minus that one that was insanely overpriced for that dead team of the season pack. Everything else I think we got, right? Nice. All right. So. Um, EA ends weekend league early and gives a 45k pack in objectives. Wait, what? That's what it is? I thought you guys said it was good. EA screwed people out of... Wait. Where the hell did the... Oh, Premier League Cup is still there. Okay. So that's four days. 11 days for this. That's kind of... I do like that. I do like that. That's a, just a cheeky way to get some packs. Where's the objective, guys? I don't see it. Unless this may be in Milestones. I don't see it, boys. Bundesliga. I am. I must be blind. Oh, bonus objective. There it is. Play two. Play two matches in any mode, and you get a 45k pack. All right. So for the end of the epi, we'll get the 45k pack. There it is. You've pa you've gone past it loads. Yeah. Well, your dad loves loads as well. <clears throat> um. So. What do we got here? This is this so-called 50k pack, even though it's not the 50k pack. Eighty-nine us passes a dub. Not that he'd be very usable, but I think we got the La Liga SBC, uh, the La Liga La Liga coming out. I can't speak. <laughs> I think La Liga's coming, boys. Not bad at all. Okay, well, getting rid of that dupe Foden was worth. Okay, very nice. No dupes either, though. I like that. 
Okay, that was worth it. I, I would say that was absolutely worth it. Good. Lots of lots of uh, untradeable players to put into upgrades or whatever we choose to do. Okay, rare. Let's get the mega. We'll get the fifty. Did I miss anything else for content before we get back into gameplay? I'm so sorry. I'm I moaned so much in that last game. I'm gonna try and. No, oh, that's a dupe, unfortunately. Okay. Mega packs have not been good to me this year. I mean, I, I will take that shadow. Uh oh. When I have tradable? No. Oh. Uh, squad battle rewards, like I said, will be for the end of the epi, heavy bees. Okay. Do we do uh, one of those 81 plus packs with this? Isaac and Raja. Let's see. Isaac and Raja. I, I want to see if these are worth worth doing. It feels like they are. Isaac and this one. And Raja. Isaac and Raja. Is weekend league over? I thought it went till Tuesday. Uh huh. I think it goes till Wednesday actually. Unless EA ended again like the plebs that they are. Okay, one other thing I wanted to double check here is I, I haven't paid attention. So if in any of those last few packs we got a Stuttgart or a Köln player, we didn't. Okay. Are those players expensive, by the way? Or not? Nah? Now we're going to do this. Huh? Oh, there we go. One. This is where the BPM comes in so big for us, boys. This might be the only one we can do for now, but EPM to silver upgrades will start paying out. We'll get a little bit of a grind going. I have a good chunk of uh, bronze players as well to get rid of, so. How far off are we the rating? See? So this is what I'm saying. For those of you guys that are grinders like I am, look at that. Anytime you get a dupe, most of you, if you have been playing this game even two to three hours a day all year, will have a plethora of untradeable silvers. I would recommend you do this. I, I do truly believe this is a really good. I wouldn't use tradables because tradables will go up in price, especially as the week goes on. Your rare silvers that you can trade will go up in price. But your untradables? Absolutely. And who knows, right? We could we could get something pretty spicy out of this. We still have a 50k pack and uh, now an 81 plus to open. Did one 81 plus and got a Saudi team of the season? Might be worth it. I think no matter what, it's worth it. If if you if you craft them intelligently the way I just showed you guys, I think these are absolutely worthwhile. Even if you get nothing, right? I mean, I just got a I don't walk out for God's sakes. Pogba, there you go. That might be a do. Oh God, are you kidding? Please don't be a dupe. Uh, this might be the first discard. It might be a dupe. No. I. No. Oh, yes. Never mind. We're fine. Ho, ho. Good stuff. All right. Do we. Um. No, this is another problem. Where the hell do I put this Bailey now? I don't think I have. I don't think I have enough. Uh, silvers. Okay, maybe for tomorrow we yeet our bronzes into silver upgrades, so I have some more silvers to use. Bundes PP? Uh Bundes PP. Let me see here. Bundes PP. Bundes PP. Bundes PP. Oh, maybe. Marky matchups are done. When does PP is not a bad shout? When does PP not a bad shout? What is it? I needed. Was it 50 chem? Is what I needed, guys? 
50 chem is what I needed, yeah? Okay. I think then I'll fill the rest with... Maybe some Serie A players, actually. I feel like I've got a good chunk of Serie A players. Yeah, see? Rigu. 50. Right, let's see. And we get anywhere near. Required. Chem. Hello. There. Any GKs? I don't think the GKs would even help us really. I did a little bit of this. And this. Five chem off. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oops! Did that by accident! No! One chem off. One chem off. Come on. SBC brainchild. Figure it out. Um. Need him. Wait, why? Oh! There we go. I figured it out. And then we'll throw him up here. Yes! Alright! We're gonna get an 80 plus PP here, boys! No man left behind means... Oh! I'm running out of time for my games! Wait, what? Oh, okay. Come on! Alfonso Davies! No. Stupid game. I got nothing. Alright, whatevs. We're chilling. And finally, 50k pack. I'm gonna, I need to try and get two or three more uh, champs games in, boys. Two or three more. At least. Alright, 50k pack. Okay, another walkout. Unfortunately, not. Dybala! My son's second? Third favorite player behind Verratti? And probably Kylian Mbappe, as my son calls him. Dybala's gone, huh? Juve, too. I wonder if my son will still like him if he leaves Juve. My son is a huge Barca fan, and a Juve fan, and a Man City fan, and a PSG fan. Um, and... When I say, what about Leeds? He says, aren't they not even in the Premier League anymore? And then I cry. So, there's that. Isn't he going to Inter? Has he gone to Inter? Or is it may like maybe he's signing a deal? Everything but Leeds. I've tried. He's even an Ajax fan, man. You know why? Because our whole family are Ajax fans. Like, Dad, I'm an Ajax fan. That's where our family's from. Okay, what about Leeds? Nope. God help me if Leeds get relegated, dude. I'm not even going to be able to handle my own household trolling me. Anyways, it's fine. Let's get some games. Yeah, I need I need to get two or three games in, man. I need to get two or three games in. I really do. Alright, we got 40 minutes left of the... Wait, what? What happened? Oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Okay, I see, I see. 40 minutes left. I'm aiming for three games here, boys, okay? And then we're going to do our uh, red player picks and stuff. Our squad battle rewards, red player picks, all that, all that goodness. Is Leeds a type of soup? Uh, anyways, uh, Ahmed, uh, EP, hello there. Side, Faisal Raja, Storm. Oh my goodness, man! I have missed quite a few of you guys. Captain Shano, BC Sav. ARB, Judy, <laughs> Emil TK, Random, Aiden, Column, Spuds, Lammy, Josh, Sidelines, Ven, and Dunk. Thank you guys all very much for the resubs and support, man. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Much love. All right, here we go, boys. Come on, Nick. Don't be a baby, okay? Don't be a whiny, moany baby. Just play the game, man. It doesn't matter if the gameplay is delayed. Everybody has to deal with it. Oh, my. G Wiz. It's a cool team name. Um Okay. I'm gonna try. Alright, 
Come on. Come on. Positivity. Focus. Focus and positivity. Focus and positivity. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Yeah, this will be a tougher test today, Derek. They need to be at their best. But I thought they were excellent last night. Oh, no. Nice ball to switch the point of attack. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Okay. Do I have a team or no way you? Here's how it looks for the Vipers. Petr Cech stands between the posts. A bit un un uninventive for me. Dude, what? That's a goal. That's hilarious. What an impossible angle to score from. Hilarious. Dude, what is happening? No way that passes so <gasps> what a ball roll. Good goal. Good play. Is that was that a good play? That felt like it was a good play. I just annihilated two of his defenders there with a ball roll. Okay. Far too easy. That's not even the pass I wanted, but okay. Guys, please with these first touches of Doom. My fault. It was a bad play for me. I bottled it. Nice. Alexander Arnold. Etienne. McGinn. Jota. Mitchell! I mean, I'm lucky there, boys. I'm very lucky there, honestly. I thought that I actually thought that was in the net. Oh wow. What a save by Czech. Wow. What the fuck are these passes, man? Kareem Benzema making tackles? He just ran offside, putain de merde! Sorry boys. We're definitely creating the chances. I got to be a little bit better defensively, though. I'm not being. Salah. Diogo Jota. Thought I got that. No worries. Eight different attempts to get the ball. Bro, like, this game is dog shit. Eight attempts to beam again there. Wouldn't give it to me, and he gets a double bounce back tap in. Fucking, this game is so shit. What the hell, man? Again, literally not even letting me be the players I need to be. Unreal. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh my god. So delayed. So fucking delayed, man. Ah, oh, so fucking delayed. Alexander Arnold. <sighs> Great vision to switch the play. Moving the ball effectively. Literally read that play and he gets rewarded with another goal. 
Read that pay, play, blocked the shot, gets the goal anyways. How fucking rewarding. Awesome. Not much I can do, boys. That's his second double bounce back goal. Like, what can I do? Takes a touch instead of playing it first time. Sick. Awesome gameplay. Awesome gameplay. Nice read. No worries. Have the ball back again. Nice read again. What? Now with Benzema, and the pass could do damage, and just narrowly wide. Well, it's a good effort from that range, but I think the keeper had it covered. Michael Essien, Bruno Fernandes, Saka. He's off. Both of them ran offside? Really? Lovely ball over the top. Oh, right in the nick of time. And taking it away. And there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Dude, what is that touch, man? And so it is. The first half story has been written. We'll keep it rolling. I should just quit this game, but we'll keep it rolling. Oh. Imagine my shock. Yeah, run down the clock, bro. I got no time for it, boys. Let's get another game. I don't need to lose my brain cells. After the double, triple bounce back goal, I should have just quit at that point. Not worth my brain cells. See if we can get another game. Hopefully it's a bit better. It's, it's horrible across the board right now, man. I mean, who cares what the ping's showing me here? I went into an 18 ping game that was 100 ping on red connection. So... I mean, even that ping that you load into there is meaningless. I, 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 I don't know. I'm just going to play games. I, I'm done looking at actual loading in ping. It means nothing. Load in on 18 ping and you, I'm playing on 100 ping. So, I, I like, I'm just going to play. It doesn't matter at the end of the day, man. This game's so dead. I think we're going to probably be stopping at 9, guys. I, I, I mean, if I can even get 9, I still need 2 wins. I'm in the worst mood I've been in in a very long time, man. Can't play that pass ahead of Ramos. You have to, you have to literally pass it at him, right? That's terrible. Anyways, I'll take it. Terrible football. I got rewarded for being an idiot. That's what this game is all about. What just happened there? That's a tap in. What? How did Saka miss that? Huh? That was a. I thought that was a really good play. Honestly, I just don't know how. Um. 
This is horrible football. Sorry, guys. He just made... Wow, what a save by Vandersar. I feel like this game should be already 3-0, man. Oh, God. What the hell? Like, show for a pass, you D-Gens! I'm literally clicking R1 as well, and all of the guys in the box are just, like, running in behind defenders. Oh, my days. Big mistake. Unreal. Get off my dick, man! <laughs> oh! Oh my god, Trent! Holy Jesus! Oh my god! What was that? Dude, I saw Vandersar off his line. I was like, I I'm going for it. I'm going for it. He tried to cut down the passing angle. Make the pass! Oh, he overcommitted with three players. Oh, I had two players in on net there if I could make that pass. I honestly, Bruno is the most infuriating player ever to, to use. He scores sometimes, but oh my God, he's just so Fucking clunky on the ball. Awesome. I gotta sub Bruno off, man. He's gonna make me smash my desk. Oh, well, Cooper, that's fine, man. No worries, Cooper. That's great, man. Of course he's fucking celebrating. Ugh, ew, 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 ew. Okay. Of course, Cooper just leaves that pass open. Doesn't do anything. The one time I don't manually defend, Cooper walks away from the passing lane. I'll lose this game too, man. I can feel it. I feel like this game should have been about 4 nothing early. So delayed. So delayed, man. So fucking delayed. My man's AI is OP, man. It's strong. That should be a foul. Dead game. No way! What was that pass? That's another tap in! How? At one and a half bars of power, why did he pa What? I gotta calm down. This is insanity. I gotta calm down, but oh my god. No worries. Being double high pressed, though, all good. Oh. Get fucked, Messi. I'm literally being assaulted right now. How did he not get that pass across goal, man? An R1X and that was how weak that pass was? Messi's never pressed a day in his life while injured, though. High pressing my player for five minutes. <laughs> okay. Maybe I'm making that a bit too predictable, boys. I don't know. 
Dude, why, when I'm being countered, does every player I select just stand there and watch the ball? Dude, are you seeing these counters? All four of my players all just standing still. Nobody moving. Nobody doing anything. I'm gonna fucking smash my controller. Smash my goddamn controller. Oh, here we go. Someone burning the clock down because they know what series we're running. Oh my god, man. How was that last goal not headed away? Because I was manually controlling Varane to try and head the ball. So it just, like, didn't let him lock onto the ball. If I didn't touch Varane there, the AI would have headed away. Like, I just... Like I said, you're, you're, this game, you're just punished for controlling your players. And I can't switch away from that. I can't stop myself from wanting to play the game and just let the computer do everything. I just, I can't... But it's it's truly why I lose so many games, man. This guy's defending with, uh, like, Neymar and fucking goddamn DDA Drogba. There's... No fucking way, right? No way, right? But that's what my players do. But that's what my players do, man. I'm trying to play in Trenton. What, what was even that pass? Nice tackle. Just kidding. Have the ball back, my guy. This is... The worst pass ever. What? Reddit has the ball anyways, and now McGinn is in a worse position, and I'm I'm I'm. Please! Oh my god, I'm still not gonna get there! He makes a mistake, I tackle him, somehow still goes out of bounds for him. Woe is me, boys. Woe is me. My brain cells can't play this type of shit, man. Nice tackle. Just kidding, Messi. Don't worry, run in on net, man. Is this fucking happening right now? I can't, I can't do anything, guys. I can't do anything, man. Take it away. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Now can they make something happen? Maybe I shouldn't be forcing that pass, man. I mean, when I play angry, I'm terrible. So I, I think there's definitely an issue going on here. I can't keep my, if I can't keep my, oh my God. Literally beat three defenders there, and he still has another defender. Let's go! <gasps> what? Oh my God! What a play! 
I have no idea. I have no idea how Vandersar made that save. I have no idea. I just, that little bit of skill just sold three of his players and Vandersar. He literally pulled Vandersar away from the ball. What? I have no one to fucking pass to, man. McGinn! McGinn! Let's go! Can I just for once have a pass go where I wanted to, man? I beg, man. I beg. Just for once. Oh my god, the delay! <laughs> I can't play. I Guys, I can't play like this. This is impossible. Oh my fuck. I did... None of those passes have gone where I've aimed them to. <laughs> how do you guys do this every week? How do you guys do this? How do you play gameplay like this? Like, how, how do you physically play in this dog shit? Well, of course. The easiest pass of all of those passes, and he fucking intercepts it. No way. What is that seeing? Oh, I did he give me that goal because he felt bad of how many missed chances I've had. I don't. I don't think this is the type of FIFA player to give me that goal. Let's go. No, he isn't. He's just angry. He's just angry. I, I just, I don't know how you guys play this garbage. I, I don't know how you do it to yourselves. Yeah, he's just angry. Stream Sniper's mad. Um, I don't know how you guys play this, man. Genuinely, I don't know how you put yourselves through this. This is the, this is the, by far been like the worst experience I've had in three, four months of video games. This is crazy. I, I genuinely hope Armalika cuts out the last two games from this epi, which means the epi will probably be only an hour and 45 minutes, but. Oh, he's going to score here too. And Drogba is a nightmare, hey? He's so strong. Anyways. Yeah. I'm not surprised. <sighs> GG's, boys. I'm sorry, man. I, I, I gotta, like, rethink how I... How I consume this 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 gameplay and this content, man. I, I, I honestly need to rethink how I, can, I consume this content. This is just unbearable. That takes us to pro gamer. Okay, buddy. Good one. Pro degenerate, more like it. But anyhow, yeah, I gotta, I gotta figure something out. I gotta figure something out, buddies. That was, that was not enjoyable for me, and I, I honest to God, don't think that would have been enjoyable for you guys to watch. That was so bad. Five games remaining. We'll get those games tomorrow. Um, we're one win away from. A Bundesliga team of the season pick. I guess the target was nine wins. This week has been a bit of a write-off. So, um, the target was nine wins. My, my apologies for the anger and frustration there, man. I'm, I'm embarrassed. I, I truly am uh, embarrassed. But, we'll finish it off with squad battle rewards. Um, we got ourselves elite to... Oh, okay. So it's another Premier League or Eredivisie player. Interesting. Okay. Wow. That could be a really good, uh, really good pack, actually. And it walks out as a red, which is kind of fun. Um, anyways, 8,000 coins, a rare Electrum, premium gold player pack, 200k. I'm thinking maybe I cash out my team and we try and just build a Bundesliga setup. Have Bundesliga players come down uh, in price? Maybe for tomorrow's Epi, we build a Bundesliga setup, man. I don't know. Uh, all right. So premium gold player pack. And oh, yeah. These, of course, are all tradable. So W. No matter what we get here, we can trade it. 
Okay, so it's a board. 83 rated. Bundes is cheap. Yeah, that was, uh, that was really, really just not a fun gaming experience for me, man. I'm so sorry, guys. I have a migraine. A migraine from how mad the game made me. Uh, we don't have the Libertadores yet, right? So I actually think I'm going to hold on to those players. Hey, that's the dude that has the uh, silver team of the week, right? Oh, uh, sorry, not silver team of the week. The silver lounge. Yeah, game sucks, dude. I know, man. I just, I, I still, I got to figure out a way to be more entertaining for you guys, man. I mean, maybe for some of you guys, the, um, that rage and stuff was entertaining. But for me, I just not, the, it's not the content I want to create anymore, man. I'm, I, I'm, I'm exhausted. I'm genuinely mentally burnt out after what? Four games of champs? Nah, man. I got, I got to figure out a way to just try and be a little bit more calm and composed. I don't think I, uh, I don't think I got it done. Because I quit those two games. I don't think this, uh... Or is it the bonus objective counts yeah even though i technically did play four games uh we quit what two of them actually that is weird or no we played a couple games before 6 p.m right trello i'm bro right here dude i'm show. i'm showing you guys i'm not forgetting the objective so for tomorrow's epi we'll have that 45k pack we'll also have champs rewards so that should be good 25k pack Okay, a little bit dead. Now, I think our, our, our epi title today is probably going to be Squad Battle Rewards and um, We Fought Champs Gameplay, Elite Rewards, Red Pick, Fought Champs Rage Gameplay. I don't know. I don't know, man. Whatever. It is what it is. I appreciate you guys for sticking around and supporting. Sorry, the gameplay portion of today's epi was pretty toxic. And maybe not toxic, but just very moany. I I I don't even I I I'm scared to look at today's epi back for how much complaining I'm doing. So we'll try and reassess for tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. We've got five games of champs left, and uh we're hoping for at least nine wins. We need in five games to go three and two, right? To get eleven. So yeah, that's that's going to be tough. That is actually going to be tough. So we'll see if we can do it for 11 wins. We should be able to get nine. I love you. I appreciate you. What type of red pick are we going to get here? Maybe we end the epi with something big at least. Who's that? That's dead. German. I want to throw up. Earnstall makes me want to uninstall. Well, on that bombshell, we'll catch you on the flip side. Peace. I'm gonna go cry myself into my moose's fur.